Hey, let's see how the Girl Sense Radio widget works. So find it in your dock system and click on it. And it will become colorful in your dock system, indicating that it's active. And it will appear on your screen, just like that. Now the preferences will be saved from last time. So whichever station you were listening to last will pop up. And wherever you left the widget last time, that's where you'll find it on your screen this time. And it'll be the same color and everything. So to change your preferences, right click on it and click widget preferences. See? Now click on skins and here you can change the color. Let's make it strong red. Just like that. Now if you right click again and click on widget preferences, you can pick your favorite station. Here I'll show you what it is. So for each station, pick something. Let's go with salsa and oldies and just keep going. Fill out your favorite station. So now if I click on one, the salsa station should pop up. There we go. And that's how you set your favorite stations. One to five. Now to amplify the volume, click here. And to decrease it, click here. Here you can turn it on or off. And here you can go to the website of the radio station to read the names of the songs that you have been listening to and the song that's playing right now. You can also click here to go to the radio station website. Here, let's pick another station. Click on Tune. Go with Chill Out. Now what else you can do is if you right click, you can see the widget preferences, change the skin, you can check for updates in case new versions of this widget have been released, or go to girlsense.com for more widgets, you can hide or close the widget. So if we hide it, it's still going to be working, it's still going to be active. So if I want to find where it is on my screen, I click on this little button, heads up display, see, we found it, we click again, it disappears. Now if we want it to actually appear, let's click on it here, there we go, and if we close it, it stops working, and it's going to become black and white on your dock system, so you're going to have to click on it to make it work again, and wait for it to start up. And that's how easy it is, so enjoy!